to subscribe and click that bell icon to get notified of my latest uploads. Hey guys and welcome back to Simply Stry Alpha 18. So last episode I said that I'm gonna make myself a concrete mixer. And as you guys can see, we only still have the one over here. Now I just saw something really bullshit. Uh, you still need the welding torch. Uh, I thought that if I had the welding torch, rather if I had the skills, I wouldn't need the welding torch. But apparently you still need the welding torch no matter what. And I haven't seen any anywhere, so I don't know where to look for it. So I want your guys' opinion. Do you think I must spawn in one wilding torch or must I search a specific place or just want to get your guys' feedback because we've been struggling at stain 30 already. We finally have the class quest. I'll show you guys now what I did with the points I had. I think I had like seven skill points to spend. Okay, so I went over here with the labor class and I maxed out everything. We're already at number three. Now over here it says crucible, steel heads, concrete mixer and concrete. So and even now that we have this one, when I try and make a concrete mixer, it says that we need a welding torch to make it. So I have no idea where to go looking. Um, yeah, I'm actually really, uh, it's a real head scratch to me, guys. If you guys know where I have to look for one, because thus far the traders I've lo looked at, none of them had. These keep disappearing. It really bothers me. If it's going to happen during the Horde Night, I'm going to be screwed. Uh, it's, uh, I have this feeling that every Horde Night, I'm going to have to spawn in new blocks over here. Okay, so let's just quickly get this done. We have Concrete make on, Mix on us. Um, let's check over here quickly. I'm going to fill these in again, but watch. At the end of the episode, they're going to be gone again. And if they are, I'm just going to replace them with solid blocks out of the creative menu. Because this is just a waste of resources filling them in every time. And it's not like a zombie is coming by damaging them. They're just broken. It just disappears. I'm just glad the... the Blade traps haven't disappeared yet, it's just the concrete. But it's, I don't know if it's to do with the fact that it's above the blade traps or anything, but the rest have dried. That's what I don't get, the rest of them have dried, so why isn't this one drying? Okay, I should probably do this. I should have done the first row first, I think. Oops, used up all my concrete mix. At least this way we know now we're getting one side done at a time. So we're going to put this away for now. Um, I have my wrench on me because we desperately need gas. We're quickly going to go to the school since we know there's a ton of cars waiting for us over there. And this is actually busy making concrete mix of the yeah, or other cement. Let's just use this stone. Go before they destroy the cement over here. Oh, come on. Three shots right over the head. Okay, there's a zombie over there as well. But before we go for any zombie around here, let's just get this crafting. That is 24 more blocks worth right there. But yeah, it sucks, guys. There's only one way to make a mixer. If you do this, mix. There's only one recipe. And it says you need a welding torch. And unfortunately, we don't have one. That's the whole reason I wanted to, uh, to get the labor class so I'll be able to get myself a concrete mixer. And it seems the, the class itself is useless unless you have a welding torch. So I didn't even need this class. As long as I have a welding torch, I would have been able to make myself one. So let's just quickly put this away for now. Uh, oh, now that I see my repair kits over here, I was busy making... Oh, this is almost done. I'm busy making 50 in each of these workbenches. Now this is just going to be for all the stuff that we can still sell at the traders. Damn, there's so much. Um, we have the repair kits now, so let's just repair all of it. And then just dump all of it back into the chest. Okay, so I hope I didn't accidentally dump something. I actually just dumped my auger. I need to make sure that I don't dump that. I put the steel pickaxe over here because as soon as the auger has its gas and that's going to be the best choice for us at the moment. Uh, let's just repair all of this as well. That's just going to allow us to be able to have two stacks of brackets instead of three. Just going to do this and voila. Okay, now let's see, let's see. We have our lucky looter goggles. I want to see what do we need to make a motorcycle? I think, oh, that's on a mechanic, isn't it? Damn it. See, I should have gone for this class. But to make a motorcycle, do you need a welding torch anyways? Let's just check that out. Motorcycle. It doesn't say anything. Okay. Uh, chassis. Chassis, chassis. Where do I look for that? It doesn't sh uh, say what you need to craft it. Ingredients. Okay, so I'm not sure if I even need a welding torch for that one. But a motorcycle would have come in more handy. Oh, this block is also missing over here. 
Okay, so we're going to go to the school quickly. Let's just hope I have enough gas left in my tank over here. And also, we should need, just need to keep an eye out for random zombies. Because I have the real bad luck of always running into a wandering horde. Okay, so where is the school? I think it's in this direction. No, it's not. It's in that direction. Okay, but I'm still going to take this road. You know what? Have we looted this road? Dude? No, we haven't. I think we stopped... Did we even loot this one? I think we would have looted this. Uh, this is the last house on the block. I need to make sure that I loot every single house. So I don't skip anything and I get my scavenging all the way up. So this is untouched. Okay, so I definitely haven't looted this yet. And I already got the secret stash in the beginning. When we got to this town, just in case we needed it for the horde. But other than that, I haven't done the rest of the building yet. Which means there's also going to be some zombies in it. Well, look at the stutter. I just wish I could fix it already. But it's definitely the incompatibility of this mod and the game with my CPU. So I'll just have to try and make do with what I have. Okay, so, zombies. Yep, there's one over there. Let's kill you. See if there's anyone over here. Okay. So while those that are sleeping are waking up, we can just quickly focus on looting these. I think the looting itself I'll cut away unless I find something awesome. Then I'll cut it in such a way that I open it with you guys, the untouched thing, so you don't think I'm cheating or anything. Because I mean, at the moment I'm just finding ammo. Ammo itself is actually also very good, but it's no like AK or something like that. Okay, let's open this. The fat zone there. Please don't tell me that's a cop. I always get that you're confused because the fat zone so Ooh, sound like cops. Crap. Let's do this. Okay, so I'm getting mutated feral whites as spawns. That is good news and bad news. Which means our game stage is high enough, but that's also bad news because imagine running into that thing in a confined space. I should technically break through all these. Yep, there you go. I'm going to say I have to break through all these to see if there's anything good, and then I get one on my first try. Ooh, hello, one of you as well. I'm going to loot everything, guys. I need to start racking up stuff, awarding stuff, so that I can... If I need to make something, I have everything that I need. I don't have to worry later, do I have what I need or not? Okay, so there's a zombie trying to break through that door. You know what, let's just quickly kill it. Oh! Whoa, he was fast. He was insanely fast. Okay, so he's going to loot this room. Don't think there's anything awesome over here. Oh, wait. There's something back here. Oh, I still need to go get myself some gas for this thing. Damn it. I uh, completely forgot about that. So I'm just going to have to use this for now. And hopefully there's nothing else I have to break through that steel. So before we loot any more buildings, we need to go dismantle a car or two for the gas. I mean, uh, Orga is just way faster at going through stuff. Okay, some loot over there. I always have to look at the walls at a certain angle to make sure there's nothing behind the skirting, behind the board itself. I mean, sometimes you can see the paint peeling and you know, okay, there's something over there. Okay, so let's just get the shotgun ready. Because usually with vultures, hello. It's just easier shooting in the face. And with a pistol that is of narrow view. Okay, so it doesn't seem like there's anything else up here, I think. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Ammo pile. Oh, yes, AK. That was awesome. A yellow one. We only have a grey one at the moment. Okay, so there's going to be zombies here. Let's do this. I don't know what's going to be back there. Ooh! A mutated bloated walker. That thing's huge. Okay, so I think we already got all the loot, like I said. Let's just reload this. Yep, it's empty. We need to reload it all the time so we know it's going to stun the zombies at least. Like I said, guys, it doesn't do any damage, like insane damage. Wait, oh. It doesn't do insane damage, but at least it knocks the zombies down and stuns them. Hello, what are you? Skater boy. Okay, so these are also empty, I think. Let's just do this quickly again. I don't know how much it actually helps with the lag, but it does something. So I'd rather try something than nothing. Okay, so before we go for any of these buildings over here, we need a car or two. So before we loot this, I might just as well go to the school first. That way we know we have a few cars that we can wrench. 
Then I don't know if there's gonna be any cars in the houses we're gonna wrench now. Or like rather loot now. See there's a car or two over here. We've already looted this place because of the one quest. So let's just quickly wrench these cars. Um, I should really put my turret down to defend myself. But at the moment it looks okay. At least the bears are slow. They're usually in the middle or the back of the pack. So as long as I hear the zombies or feel the first zombie hit me, I should be safe. I think I really need to go visit the traders off camera a bit more. And I might just record my interaction with the traders in case I find something like a welding torch or something awesome. So if I buy it, you guys don't think I spawn it in. As I hate it when YouTubers just all of a sudden, with a new episode, they have all these awesome weapons all of a sudden. And you don't know if they really found it or spawned it in. So, but I really need to do that because on camera, it's just really tedious driving around the whole time. But off camera, I can drive around all I want and then just record my findings at the traders. And if I find something awesome, I can just splice that into the video. If not, then it's nothing lost in your, or your time or whatever. Okay, so let's see. Can I wrench this as well? Oh, nice. But am I going to get any gas from it, though? Uh, headlights. There you go. Wait, does this thing have more than one stage? Yeah, it does. Okay, so now I'm getting gas. Nice. It's just a shame it's so into the ground. You can't really tell what it looks like. Ooh, frame. <laughs> you can barely see the frame. That's how it's sunken into the ground this thing is. You know what? I might just work my way backwards. Because we need to go down that road and then come down to over here. But what if we go from here up? That, that means we can get the loot on top of this home dep uh, depot. And then also there, I think there's a ton of loot in that place as well. So then we know at least we're getting good loot. You know what? Let's just quickly do this. Need to fill this up, and then with the rest of the gas, fill up my bike. I don't know if it's enough to fill up. Nope, it's not. Okay, so with these three cars of yeah, are these? No, wait, you know what? I'm gonna cut away. I'm quickly gonna arrange all of these cars. Let's just see if there's anything awesome in them. Should get my shotgun out just in case something spawns from this noise. But I want to arrange these off camera quickly so the tedious work is out of the way, and then we can go through this place together. Let's see. Imagine all of these have alarms. Okay, let's quickly arrange these. I actually really want to get to that repair shop over there. Because thinking about it, there might just be a working concrete mixer over there. Even if it's a little bit away from my base, it's just a drive away, a short drive. If I can have another one working like that, we can have twice as fast concrete mix. At the moment, we're really struggling collecting our concrete mix. Also guys, I've been so busy thinking about this game and what I want to do next, that I forgot to share the awesome news. They just installed fiber at my house. They just need to come connect the little box inside the house now tomorrow. And then, voila, fast internet. Oh, wow. I didn't even notice the car. I searched it, but I didn't even loot it. But yeah, um, or rather I searched it, but I didn't wrench it. But yeah, so hopefully either by this weekend or even sooner than that, I'll have super fast internet. I just need to work out then why I'm getting so much lag in game. And also verify the load shedding schedules. And then on days there's no load shedding and I sort this out, we can start streaming again. And that's, the, that's how I actually got the bulk of my subscribers, streaming. I just haven't been able to since I don't have a really good internet. Okay, let's just put everything away that we don't need right now and stuff that we can sell we'll keep. But these I need to keep on me. I always dump those. And then later I search them but uh, they, I already took them off me. Okay, so we're just going to dump everything we don't need. Be right back. Okay, so I think the rest of this stuff will most likely stack. Um, I think I've taken more or less everything out of my inventory now that can't stack. There's still a few things, like for example, steroids, they don't stack, stuff like, you know what, I can actually do this. Scrap that, put the steroids in there. But yeah, most of this will stack at least, so now my inventory is full. I really need a Jeep or a motorcycle as soon as possible. Okay, so let's just do this. We want to see how fast I can actually level up now. And how fast I can clear these buildings. Let's just give a shot or two. Hello, wake up. There you go. There you go. I just want to see where they are so I can more or less cheat without having to worry about running out. Because I mean, if you have to reload and they're super close, you're screwed. Oh wait, there's something behind you. Also guys, this is a place where there's a ton of hidden stuff. I want to show you guys this. Some of you new to this, your eye might have missed it, because a lot of people even miss it. Even big YouTubers always miss this dude. Okay, so let's just do this. Bullseye, bullseye, close that door. I think we're supposed to go up this side, yep. So 
So let's just clear out the rest of this place quickly. Just want to make sure there's nothing hiding around the corner for me. Oh wait, I might just fall from upstairs. I need to watch out for that. Especially with my insane jumping skills. I still can't believe we ran right over the one sleeper last episode. We were looking everywhere for that zombie. And meanwhile, I actually ran right over him and he didn't even notice me. I didn't notice him because I thought it was just a dead zombie. And he didn't notice me because I think I weigh nothing. <laughs> this character of mine weighs zero. That's the only excuse I can think of for him not feeling me walk right over him. Okay, so let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I think I'm starting to get sick because my voice is very deep today. <laughs> okay, so let's see what I can find over here. To make sure we are reloaded and ready to go. No zombies on that side, but they might just be on this side. I'm, I wish they could actually add zombies like sitting on the toilet. I know that's a weird, maybe kind of perverty thing to <laughs> hope for, but that would look so awesome. Oh crap. That guy was a uh, muted one, I think. Hello. That is just feral. I was wondering why it took so many shots. It's feral. At least since I'm killing so many zombies, I'm leveling up quite nicely. And I think the XP is only set to 150 like I did in the beginning of the series. But I'm still getting a ton of XP, which is very awesome. So, I think we can go up that ladder over there. Let's just make sure this place is cleared. I don't want to fall through the floor all of a sudden to get, uh, just to get to the bottom again. I know sometimes the floor is real cave-in floor all the way. But this seems to be a legit floor. Okay, there's going to be a ton of vultures outside, if I'm not mistaken. But the, luckily we have our trusted shotgun. So it's going to make short work of those vultures, those pesky birds. Okay, so we're going to go in here. It's a shame you can't double tap your space to jump really high and just one tap to jump that short distance. I mean, like now, I really struggled just because I can jump so insanely high. Okay, so we're going to place this right there. That's going to call some of the zombies, and there's more. There has to be more over here. There's usually a ton. Bullseye. Okay, now. Ooh, you really gave me a fright. Damn. That really gave me a fright just now. She literally came out of nowhere. Okay, so. That is already looted. Make sure this is. Okay, guys, for those of you that just picked that up, look at this. The seam is gone. So you just do this, and there's loot in here. There's quite a few of these boxes in this place. I wonder if there's anything hidden underneath over here. Doesn't see... No, it's not. Uh, we don't need that at the moment, so we're just going to throw that away. But there are more of these boxes. You need to keep an eye open for these. Okay, there's nothing over here. That's where they came from. Ooh. Late spawner, and he didn't even hear me or see me. Nice. Okay, so once again, let's check behind here. There's nothing, but there is something right over here. A lot of people miss it. Sometimes there's like um, ammo piles. Other times it can just be crap. But you always need to check that out. Okay, so where do I need to go now? I think through here. Yeah. Okay, let's go up. Just grab my trusted shotgun. And I really, really love the shotgun. It's overpowered as hell. But at least it draws in a ton of zombies because of the noise. That's the biggest th That's the only reason I'm using this OP thing. Usually I'll just... I'll try something that makes me struggle a bit more. But the fact that it's so noisy, that's the awesome part. You never have too few zombies to fight. Here's, one of, here's more of those things. Okay, this seems to be lootable, but I don't know where to loot it from. Okay, it's more ammo pile. This seems like desks, but I can't loot. Okay, there you can loot that one. It seems you can only loot from the front, which means... Oh, that one's empty, that's why. Okay, so I think I'm done with this room. Ooh, this is untouched. Thank you. Oh, no, 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 no. Why did I just do that? Thank you. We need to make space. We have way too much clothing on us at the moment. And not all of it's really worth anything. So the stuff that's worthless, we're going to scrap. And then the rest of the stuff, we might just eat and drink. Ooh, coffee. We know that one. There's a ton of stuff already we can scrap to get the resources. I know you don't always have to scrap them. Um, you only get like 75% of whatever you're scrapping. But it's space. Uh, we need the space. Okay, so, shotgun at the ready. I think this room might also have one of those boxes, but I might be wrong. Yeah, I'm wrong. Okay, just need to check that out. Sometimes it's everywhere, sometimes it's nowhere. 
So we're gonna go out this room. I wonder how many zombies are down there. Just one wandering zombie or a wandering horde? Okay, so we need to get up here. Now as soon as we get to the top, there's actually gonna be a few tough zombies up there. So let's just make sure this guy is reloaded. Yep, he isn't. This is 50 more seconds and I can get some more space in my inventory. So we're just gonna drop this. Where are all the zombies? Sometimes they're right in plain view, like this guy over here. Um, you know what? Let's do this. You can handle those, and I'll handle this guy. Come on, come on, come on! I need to focus on those guys as well. Who is a cop? Oh wow, that was a mutated cop. No wonder he was so huge. There's another cop. Oh crap. Oh wow. That could have been. Ooh, this guy is feral and he is way too fast. So, as you guys know, some of the zombies are just randomly set to nightmare speed. That's why that guy just. He, he was super speed. He was super sonic. Actually, it reminded me of the Eminem MM, 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 MM rap. Ugh, tongue twister. Okay, so do we still. No, I don't think we have to fall down there. What is this? Oh, we could have gotten up from here. Which means these zombies could have fallen in our heads, but for some reason they don't really hear me. Which I should really not be complaining about. Okay, now we need the space. So let's just start scrapping stuff. This guy, ooh, it's going to sell for quite a fortune, so I can't really scrap that one. And we can actually technically eat that. Because that's going to allow us to eat this and make a little bit more space. This is 25%. I wonder if you can actually get food poisoning if you're on those uh, vitamins. I mean, I'm eating dog food. Okay, so my food is insanely high, but my water, insanely low. What do I need to up to get my food up? Or rather, my water up. My food is all the way up there. Wait, that? Yeah, that's food. So what am I missing over here? Okay, there might just be more zombies. I need to watch out. Let's just quickly get through this place. So we just need to open this, and before I open that, let's just wear the goggles. Hit in the stash. Eh, purple. Come on, please, welding torch. Please, welding torch. I'm getting everything that's expensive except the welding torch. I wonder, is the welding torch not expensive and not considered good loot or something? Is I really struggle getting those. Okay, so this stuff, yeah, I'm going to sell that. It's 100 and something, I'll keep that. Anything over 100 for now, I'm desperate <laughs> for, ca uh, for cash, as much as possible. So anything over 100 I'll keep for now. Usually it's anything over like two, 300, but I, I can't be picky. So now, next building is we're going to go up the road. I wonder what's that side. There might just be some awesome buildings over there. Let's see if I can jump this down without breaking my leg. At least we can fall from a great height without really getting hurt. So I should be able to make that jump. There you go, nice. Okay, now where is that zombie going? Is he inside? If he's not all the way oh, hello. Honestly, if he's not all the way through, I'll be able to kill him and get the XP. And I was able to kill him and get the XP. <laughs> okay, so as soon as I have more chance, I really need to scrap more things. That seems like an army base. I think that's the direction of the... Red Mesa facility, isn't it? Anyways, I'm gonna loot this one first. This church is... I don't think this one has a basement. Yes, there's awesome loot in there. But first we're going to run through this place. And let's just do this quickly. Uh, this and this. But that's not going to work because there's no open slots. Okay, I, sh I should really dye everything. Because if I dye everything, there's two more slots. So for example, this one has dye on, but these two don't. So if I take that off, you know, black dye you need for ink. So I'll just keep that one there. The shotgun and the compound crossbow. Ooh, a purple one. That's really going to come in handy, I think. Okay, so I don't think my shotgun has... Oh, it has white on. It just, it dyes it. It's, um, what do you call it? It's like when you go to, uh, for your hair and you don't... It doesn't... If you go for blonde, for example, it, it bleaches. It bleaches the thing. It doesn't color it exactly. Okay, so I'm just quickly going to make some more space and then we're going to head inside. Okay, so technically our inventory is seriously full. I don't know if I... Whoa, I thought that was a snake. I don't even know if we're going to have enough... Um, yeah, enough space for all the loot in here. 
Okay, so that was the timer, but I want to finish this place. I really need to finish this place. Okay, are they outside or inside? That sounds kind of inside. I might just come around the corner surprising me right now. So I really need to keep an eye on that. Ooh, more recipes. Nice. I just need that damn welding torch. Come on, I need to kill whatever's outside. Oh, crap. Uh, shotgun. Thank you. What's outside? Ooh. What's outside, though? Are they breaking in, or are some of them inside already? No, they seem to be inside. They're breaking out the roof, I think. I just need to watch out. I always miss a room in this place for some reason. I need to make sure we loot everything. Hello? Oh, wow. A radiated burn victim. That's the first time I've ever seen a guy like that. And they're breaking out those rooms over there. Which we really need to be careful of. Yeah, they're coming from over here. So, I don't want to open that with an axe because... <laughs> Let's see if I can do this. Ooh, nice. That was awesome. Okay, ooh. Please tell me there's a concrete mixer over here somewhere. I just need one concrete mixer to solve my problems. Wait, what's that? Ooh, boar. I think I need it for the meat. No, I don't. Okay, there's a ton of zombies out here for some reason. Although I shouldn't really complain because it's free XP and we need those skill points. So the problem now is we need to get another class going, a class quest. But it takes 120 of those notes. And we struggled so, uh, so hard the first time. I don't know if it's going to be possible getting a third or... Well, we have three now. Uh, I don't think it's going to be possible getting a fourth class. Bullseye! I'm so lucky he just got stuck. I mean, at least I have my shotgun, so I should have been able to kill him fast. But that just saved me some time and effort. Damn. Okay, there's something underneath here. Yeah. No zombies falling down, so we can go for this. And jump. So next episode we're going for... I think we should first finish the street before we go for anything else. Before we go for like the Red Mesa or something like that. The Red Mesa, I might just go for the secret stash loot in that uh, one loot room. I might just go for the secret right off the bat. Because you can, uh, you can go through the whole place. Um, it's totally plausible. But it wastes so much time just to get to that one room that has a ton of stuff in it. So I think we should go in. No, 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 no. Did I just fall down? Did I just fall down? Okay, so where do I get back up? Nice thing is I have insane hopping skills. So it's not too hard to get back up. I just you watch. I, I must stand on this one and then jump. Okay, now I think let's just place a frame. It's going to ensure that we don't fall down again. Although you can't actually stand there. Crap. Come on, man. No, that really sucks. It's not my fault that I can jump that high. And that everything else is in the way at the moment. I swear I'm going to make that a whole bigger with my fire axe. I think you were definitely supposed to go in here, but for some reason, I keep, well, not for some reason, I have insane hopping skills, so I keep bumping my head. Uh, let's do this. If we take this away, we should be able to place a frame there. Yes. Oh, Wandering Ward, first going to do this. Nice, there's a crop in between as well. I don't see a bear. Let's just get this crop first. Oh, that was a radiated, oh not radiated, oh, a mutated one. These tall guys are mut a mutated, oh there's another cop. I'm gonna get hit. I really need to get out of the way from the cop's vomit. Come on, come on, come on, thank you, and bullseye. Whew. Okay, so there's a burn victim over there. I wonder if more passed. These should be the last two stragglers on this wall. I really want to get into that loot room, but I keep getting interrupted. And there's so much good loot around here. There's loot. There's secret stash in there. There's secret stash in there, I think. Well, I haven't been into one of those yet. I'm just... Uh, that's uh, that Oprah thing of everyone's getting that. You're getting one. You're getting one. Come on, come on, come on. Up. At least we have that one frame down over there, so it should be faster getting in. That's if I don't fall through holes and stuff. Okay, so. Shotgun is at the ready. Bullseye, thank you. Reload while you guys come at me. The nice thing is, this shoots right through zombies. That's the best part. Okay, and my auger has a ton of gas in it, so let's just quickly get this iron. I mean, why not? If not, why not? Let's do this. I just need to make sure I don't skip the loot. Oh, is this a loot room? 
I think the first time I couldn't get up here or something. And I skipped it accidentally. Okay, and now I don't have any space for the good loot. So let's just put on my goggles. Ah, oh, they're still on. So I didn't get any good XP. Damn, that was a mistake. That was an insanely huge mistake, guys. Because that could have gotten me a ton of XP just now. Okay, so, uh, drink, scrap, drink, dump. Okay, so now I should have enough to whatever's in here. Where do we find... Please tell me there's one in here. A walling torch. Oh, a walling torch. Nope. Guys, seriously, please comment down below. I'm really at wit's end at the moment. I just feel like spawning on in and then going from there. Because we just need one wilding torch. Just the one. And as soon as we have that, we can make ourselves a concrete mixer. I could have sworn there's another room to this place. Am I overthinking this? Yeah. Oh, wow. Just... Oh, the first time I think I didn't know th uh, notice you can go through this window. So I had to break through the wall of here. But yeah, if you guys like this episode, please like and share with your friends. Any comments or tips or feedback, especially on that wilding torch, guys, please leave your comments down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for this content. See you guys next time.